hey guys how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to the channel i ordered stuff from amazon.co.uk here that i want us to unbox we're going to take this stuff out and see what is inside So this is what we have here. We got this sandbar. This is Ultimate Apollo X60 Dolby Atmos Dolby Vision 4.1 immersive sound, 4.1 immersive clang, Bluetooth connection, HDMI, and 4K HDR. What I want to do is unbox this stuff, check it out, and see what is inside. Ultimate bias technology split fit unit to beat. So let's check this stuff out. It's 4.1 channel soundbar Dolby Atmos. What is in here? This is the manual, and this side back is detachable. I like the recycled plastic packaging. There we go, brilliant stuff. And see what it looks like. Very. This is the part of the sound. The sound bar is detachable. This is the second part. Brilliant. This is a brilliant stuff. You can see what it looks like. Ultimate. In front of it, it's metal grill. Then the back is plastic. So the way this goes is just, you need to go inside here. You need to go in. There we go. So once you put it inside, you need to put it inside together. Then twist it. So this is very beautiful because it's detachable so you can position it as you like. This is the subwoofer here. Let's see what the subwoofer look like. Nice. There's a black clothing here. The rest is wood. Apollo X60 S50 This is HDMI cable Remote control And The cables Optical cable included and the power cable.
Ultimate 4.1 channel Dolby Atmos Soundbar for Smart TV 2 in 1 Bluetooth 5.3 Soundbar for TV with subwoofer 280 watts peak power 3 equalizer mode TV Soundbar Bass Boost HDMI EAC Apollo X60 Detachable Series This Soundbar will elevate TV sound with Dolby Atmos versatile and saving space wired subwoofer with enhanced bass personalized sound experience upgrade integrated sdp chip seamless connectivity apollo s60 soundbar for tv has wired and wireless dual connection option including hdmi optical auxi usb port all cables included Bluetooth 5.3 technology ensure fast connection speed, loseless audio transmission, and accessories included. You yeah. got two bays for you to stand the sandbar. Remote control included. HDMI cable, optical cable. Stereo RC 3.5 millimeter audio cable. You also have four pin cable for sandbar connection. Four pin cable for sandbar connection. Screws, the power cable, and the two sandbar detachable one and subwoofer. These are the stuff that included in the packaging. You also have wall brackets. So this, this stuff needs to be 11 in total. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Now from this sandbar, you can switch this on and off input for you to this button here is input for you to select HDMI optical. This plus is for you to increase the volume. Minus is for you to decrease the volume. You can switch this on from here and control it. But remote control is included. But you need to put your own battery. Battery is not included in the packaging. This is the remote control. And from this remote control, you switch the sandbar on and off from here. You can see HDMI EAC. AD in optical auxi bluetooth and usb all the connections here you just need to do the connection and select the particular one then the center one is pause and play then this button here is for you to go forward and this button here is for you to go back to the next track forward to the next track plus and minus minus is for you to plus is increase the volume minus is for you to decrease the volume also you have three equalizer mode which is have movie game and music you also have bars post this button here is for you to mute the audio ports for this samba so you have oxy ports goes in here you have optical hdmi out eac hdmi in usb port dc in the power cable goes in to dc in sub out the subwoofer cable goes in here and this is for you to connect sandbar together use four pin cable this is the wall mount this wall mount cable goes in here this is where it goes just need to slide it in yeah this is wall mount other one goes in here as well it goes into the second one it's in so this is the second wall mount is to show you how to set this sandbar up first of all you need to get triple air battery it's not included in the packaging so you need two triple air batteries so you take negative to your right side negative will be on top the bottom one is positive then to the left negative will be on the bottom the top one will be positive 
okay and it's in then you close it just slide this up okay the remote control is ready now this sandbar depending on how you want to set this up you can it's very detachable so if you want to set them the sandbar up to be in this format flat then you need to slide it in from the setting clockwise front once you fit in the setting then turn it to your right so that it will link up this is if you want to leave this sandbar to be in this format flat okay so if you want it to be in flat then you need to be in this format but if you want to have it with the base then you detach it okay and take the base this is the base then you just need to take the base and slide it in just need to go. so take the one part of the sandbar then go in and twist it to your right and this this one is done then you take this this one as well then turn it turn it to your right now this is the subwoofer here Then this subwoofer need to go to this subwoofer need to go to plug it into the sub out. Okay. Now take the power cable. Take the power cable to DC in. Plug it onto the socket. Now this cable then need to be connected. So this cable is four pin cable for sandbar connection. So this goes here. So you take the cable, go in to the sandbar, and it's in. So then take the other end of the cable, connect it to the next the other sandbar. Push it inside and it's in. So the cables, so you need to take DC in, is the power cable. The, the center one will be subwoofer and the third one will be connection for the two sandbar. What I want to do is to show you how to hook this sandbar okay, so up this is, to your TV is, via Bluetooth. This sandbar is connected to this TV via HDMI ARC. And this is the cable here. What I want to do is to show you how to hook this up to TV via Bluetooth. So what I'm going to do now is unplug HDMI cable. 
from the soundbar and also unplug it from the TV. You also need to make sure the soundbar is in Bluetooth and when it's in Bluetooth you will see a BT showing us BT. We need to go to TV settings, use the gear button to go to TV settings. Now scroll down to the sound, you need to select sound out from, on your TV, scroll down to Bluetooth, scroll down to device list and they will start to look for available device. So it's searching for available Bluetooth device. Here we go. Apollo X60 is available. So you need to select on it. Connected. And it's connected. So this sound banner and TV are connected together. And when it's in Bluetooth, you can control the volume using the sound bar remote. You can also control the volume using the TV remote. Being distraught or grateful for some peace and quiet. Violet, as you can see, is stuffing her little face rotten with this eucalyptus. Uh, yeah, she's literally as chilled as they come. She doesn't really care. And, uh, and this is a movie. It's very much like she knows yeah. she's trustworthy. And she just sent her little child off to school. And then uh, she knows we... This is music. Uh, no stress at all. I would like to put this in movie. Wow, that's gone fast. Hasn't it? <laughs> so the sound is a lot be so better with movie. This is definitely up there with... <laughs> Just gonna remove the optical cable. Okay. This is beautiful. So this is the optical cable. Okay. Just gonna, so now we need to plug the sound bar in. Okay. And plug the TV in. Okay. Now switch the sound bar on. When you switch it on, the this light will be here. So you need to use the input. Select the input. Bluetooth. You can see it's going into Bluetooth. Select pairing. Ready to connect via Bluetooth. Okay, ready to connect via, via Bluetooth. Please like, share, and subscribe. It helps the channel. Thank you very much indeed. And stay blessed. Thank you.